Hi, my name's Karen, and I have a blog called The Homeschool Bunch. It's thehomeschoolbunch.com. And I have created this blog to create a group of women who will encourage each other and support each other to be kind of a support group. Our, in our world, we women are judged by our looks, by how much we make or how much our husband makes or what kind of car we drive or what kind of clothes we wear and how we look in those clothes. All these things come into factor, and sometimes we get so hung up on it. I want us to create a group where we start stepping out and going, you know what? I want to make myself a better person. I want to be a better woman of God. If we're married, I want to be a better wife. I want to be a better mom. I want to be a better, maybe we're a grandparent. Maybe you are an older person who did not have children or do not have grandchildren. God's put people in your life that he wants you to make a difference. Maybe you've come here and you don't know anything about God and you're struggling in your home life or you're struggling in just your personal life. Hopefully we will have things that we address in this blog and also maybe in the links that I provide because I'll be referring you to a lot of other people. The internet is just so full of so many wonderful blogs by women of God and hopefully you'll check those out. I have come to a point that I know that I need to do a lot better. I need to lose a lot of weight. I want to start a home business. I want to excel in my homeschooling with my children. I want to be a fantastic wife and support for my husband. I want to be an asset to my church and to be in ministry and to be reaching out to people every single day, whether I'm at the gas station, the grocery store, or here in front of my computer. Join me in this blog. Let's see where it goes. Um, you may have been somebody that caught me on Facebook and you've been friends with me since high school. You may be somebody that just found me through a search. Whichever, I welcome you. I love that you're here. And let's just take this road together and start on this journey. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see me from the very beginning, which is now. And through the next few years, you'll be like, wow, I walked together with this girl. I know what she's been through. I know she's not perfect. And I would love to see your successes too. Because I'll be putting a lot of success stories on my blog too. Um, some things that we will cover will be homeschooling. There will be some about helping your child if they are in school. You may be a working, you may have to work. And, you know, I have been blessed enough that we've been able to stay, I've been able to stay at home. But I hadn't always been able to do that. I was a teacher. I was also in, in youth and children's ministry. Um, I've even in high school worked at a grocery store. So <laughs> I've done it all. Um, we want to cover Number one, our spiritual walk. Number two, how are we supposed to step out and serve God? Also, family. Also, being frugal, taking care of what God's given us, being a good steward of it. Taking care of our health because this is our temple. I have abused God's temple right here so much, and I want that to change. Also, of maybe special needs children. I have a child that's on the autistic spectrum, and a lot of parents struggle with that. Maybe our, you know, our child children are just struggling. You can see that my house is not perfect. It's just a plain old house. I let my kids hang up stuff on the wall that are crazy, but that's what they love. And they're going to be kids for only a little while, and they'll be gone, and all those memories will be gone. So you'll see a lot of imperfections, and um, hopefully you will continue to come and check out the blog, check out the Facebook page, check out our YouTube channel, check out Twitter, all the links that we have, and hopefully it'll be a blessing to you. And plus, it'll be keep me accountable so that I can do everything that God wants me to do. And hopefully, you will be inspired in the end to step out and to do what God wants you to do. I look forward to sharing more with you. Thanks a bunch.